late night at my gun bench. So tonight I'll be taking the 223 out of this Jay Allen stock that I borrowed from Tyler. And I've taken out the bolt. I already checked the chamber. There's nothing in there. And I will be using two Allen keys. Well, I'll be showing you guys two different sets. I have the Wheeler um, 30 hex and uh, torque set. And I also have the DeWalt Allen key set. And let's use the DeWalt first. So um, it, you know, goes angle, it can go straight, or it can be like this. So for the one in front, we're just going to have it straight. And I can reach that screw. But once I really get in there, this metal thing right here, it kind of just gets in the way of me turning it. And then in the back, um, the screws right back here. And I can't even reach it. I mean, let's try 90 degrees. And I can reach it like that, but everything just gets in the way. Uh, you know, it's just not working out for me. So I'm just going to use um, the wheeler and it just slides right in. I can just unscrew it. My life is a lot easier. And I always have it on my gun bench. So backstory on why my DeWalt is pink and really ugly. It's for gear drift prevention. I often lend my gear out to people at the range. And you know what? Allen key sets look all alike and I tend to lose them. But ever since I've done that, I've never lost it. It's been five years. I still have it. So make your stuff ugly. <laughs> Now I'm ready to take this action and drop it in my new stock.